Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her King. Let every heart prepare Him rule. And heaven and nature sing. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, you're wet. You're outside. How long, Beth? How long are you going to punish me for? <laughs> and heaven and nature sing. And heaven and heaven and nature sing. Joy to the world, the Savior reigns. Let men their songs employ, while fields and floods, rocks, hills and plains repeat the sounding joy. Repeat the sounding joy. Repeat, repeat the sounding. No more let sins and sorrows grow, no thorns infest the ground. He comes to make his blessings flow, for as the curse is found, for as the curse is found, for as, for as the curse is found. He rules the world with truth and grace and makes the name. So day 24, Merry Christmas Eve. And I'm sorry you guys for like the lack of footage these last few days, but they have been hellacious and long and full of work. The last three or four days, I've worked doubles where I worked at my main job and then picked up shifts at my old job. And I've just been exhausted. This past weekend, yeah, I'm holding you guys so you don't like move because I'm making the sharp ramp turn. This past weekend, I did a lot of socializing at my work Christmas party, which was great. I hate to admit, uh, well, actually, no, we all got sloshed and schnockered, um, but it was great. We did our Secret Santa exchange. The guy that I thought was my Secret Santa, I was correct, and uh, he's not a very good liar, so he didn't, like, secretly question me to find out things about myself. Just gave me something that he figured everyone could use, and that's, he gave me a $25 Walmart gift card. So I was just like, yes, I can definitely use it. Actually, I put it to good use last night because a good friend of mine is not feeling well and wanted to do like a lazy night, movie night slash ice cream night. So I raced to Walmart last night after I got off work from my old job to get some treats for us. But yeah, after I left that, so there was going to be an after party, but I found out my coworkers got too wasted to even go out, so I ended up meeting up with Chris Elise. She took me to um, another Christmas party where actually I ran into someone from my past. A guy that I always seem to run into like once every five years. And we had this 
three-way thing in common that was just hilarious, but I'm not going to get into that. Or as you saw, Chris Elise actually got sick. She had to be taken to a hospital and didn't want to come home to the house. So I stayed with her. And yeah, I'm racing back home and then actually going um, to be with my parents because I'm basically the only child that ever helps my mom cook for Thanksgiving and Christmas. And I technically have not wrapped. What is this guy doing? Like, I'm driving slow to let you on. Um, I have not wrapped any of my Christmas gifts. I'm horrible. When I was a kid, I used to be really creative, where I would, like, wrap everything perfect with ribbon and add little ornaments and stuff like that. I don't know what happened to me, because I'm still a pretty creative person, but when it comes to wrapping gifts, it's just a bag of tissue paper. But, um... Yeah, I'm racing home, and then I have to, I think I might be going to church with my parents, I'm not sure, for Christmas Mass, and then I gotta help my mom cook, and then my parents are actually going out of town to like, some snowy mountain place or something, and so I'm gonna be house-sitting for them. Which, unfortunately, you guys are not going to see, because it's going to be after Christmas. But yeah, that's about it. I'm off today uh, for my main job. Kind of the veterans, all the full-time veterans at my job were all stuck working today, even though they, we were only open until 2, and they were getting paid for a full day. But still, they weren't really... They weren't being mean about it, but I could tell that they weren't happy about it. But yeah, my first Christmas Eve ever that I've been off probably in over eight or nine years since I, like, got my first couple of jobs doing retail. But I'm going to enjoy my time off, maybe do some editing. I should really go run. But it's gotten really cold, which doesn't bother me. I prefer to run in the cold. I don't know, I might. Depending on when church is, when I have to start helping my parents, mainly my mom cook, that will probably determine whether or not I run or I do uh, like a P90X workout. But anyway, I will attempt to chime in back with you guys in a little bit. And hopefully I'll get some editing done, because I don't think I've uploaded anything since day 6 and 7. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Alright, bye! The glories of His righteousness and wonders of his love and wonders of his love and wonders and wonders of his love Vlogmas experience being in my first Vlogmas experience has indeed been very interesting and kind of a fail almost since just because I've been so late with uploading videos and I already know that these last couple of days are probably not going to be uploaded until after New Year so Happy New Year by the way I hope all you guys had a safe and wonderful uh, time reign in the New Year 2014 um, but yeah, and then the lack of footage, only because you guys probably have a better understanding of how much I work 
and unfortunately the fun like social things I do did involve friends who are aware of my YouTube life so I didn't just want to you know whip my camera out everywhere yeah day one probably was definitely the most successful because I had a day all to myself to film everything but I hope you guys you know enjoyed at least getting a few more personal glimpses into my life um some of you guys have learned some interesting facts like the fact that I don't sleep um but yeah basically my family we we ate uh my dad finally put on um I feel like one of the best Christmas movies ever World War Z and I'm not kidding like I actually did enjoy it me I kind of disrespected my zombie fascination by just now seeing this movie today. But anyway, thoroughly enjoyed it. And, uh, we all took naps, and that's basically it. I don't plan on going anywhere today. And I actually think I didn't do this Vlogmas thing completely correctly, because I see that most of the YouTubers that do it, they stop filming on Christmas Eve, and I am filming, you know, this last day. But yeah, this is going to be it. I will definitely be doing this again next year. We'll definitely hope, hopefully have more interesting footage. Um, because me looking back on some of the previous days, I'm like, oh my god, why would anyone be interested in watching any of this crap? And here's a little clue into my personal life. Hopefully this time next year, um, I will be in a different location. Um, 2014, I do plan on moving into an apartment. Uh, so yeah, um, getting out of this older house and, you know, an apartment that I can definitely be more creative in and have more personalization with. But anyway, um, I guess the last thing I can show you is some of the things that I've got, and this is not everything, and everything's kind of been put up, so I'll have to walk and grab the things. Um, and this is not everything, and I hate to say that I do have some friends that I will be exchanging with after Christmas because I haven't seen them yet to give them their Christmas gifts. Um, but yeah, you guys are aware that uh, my best friends Ferdy and Pam got me Call of Duty Ghosts. My parents got me this Under Armour hat, which only people who know me personally will know this fact, but the fact that they got me this hat is really funny. For those of you who may know about the comic book app Bit Strips, my Bit Strips character actually has on a hat that's styled like this. It's like red and blue, but still, I just thought it was funny that my parents gave me that. This was the Secret Santa gift that I got from my coworker Steven. Um, and it, it, inside this box was a $25 Walmart gift card, which I greatly appreciated, even though I hate Walmart. Still, it's useful. Someone else who sells Mary Kay gave me, um, this bag that has, like, three products in it. Um, Mary Kay Satin Hands. This is a hand scrub. A fragrance-free hand softener. And a fragrance-free hand cream. So, I'll definitely put those to good use. My parents got me this coat. It's going to replace the coat that I used to wear every day. But it is a Calvin Klein French coat, which it looks so fashionable, so luxe, and the fact that I'm holding it like this does not give you any idea of what it looks like. It has really nice blue piping. I don't know if you can see that on the inside. And a detachable hood, so it'll be good in the rain. And good in the cold. They also wanted me to have like a more professional looking coat because at my job I do tend to wear business attire and like suits and stuff so that would look great on my suits. My bestie Chrysalis, she actually got me. Personal fact about myself is that I will be going with my parents and hopefully it will be vlogged um, a trip this summer, and hopefully I'll get all the time off from my job, um, to Europe for 10 days, and blue's my favorite color, and she loves glitter, so she got me this passport cover, 
and tags for my luggage, which I actually do need because my luggage is so bland and conventional looking that normally when I go to baggage claim, I mistake other bags for my bags. So the fact that I have those glittery name tags, very, very helpful. Uh, my parents, they're the ones who got me using the Jessica Simpson Fancy Fragrance. Well, I remember when it first came out, that was a fragrance I told them I liked. So, they always just give me, like, a Jessica Simpson fragrance each year for Christmas. And so, this is the Vintage Bloom set. That has all of those products in it. None of this stuff I'm going to swatch because... I don't want to open all these things since they're not going to be used right away. But I also got a goodie bag that has the Tarte's Lights Camera Lashes Mascara, which I've used before and I liked. Two mini Estee Lauder Pure Color Cajal Eyeliners, which, um, if you've seen my most recent Getting Ready With Me video, um, I always line my top eyes, or my top eyes, my top eyelid, uh, with, uh, a Kajal, that Kajal liner. This is the Estee Lauder Lipstick in Blushing. And Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme Mascara. And then this lovely Estee Lauder eyeshadow palette, and it has a blush right there. And then another gift bag that I got. So very funny. If you've been subscribing to me for a while, you'll know that I already own this product. But this is Poopery. It's fantastic. And I was actually running low on the stash that I got for my birthday like two years ago. So got a new bottle of that. And the last two things are Tarte's Smolderize Eye Pencils. These are like um, cream eyeshadow pencils that can be used as eyeliner. And these... Um, I initially did swatch these when I first opened the gift, and after they set, they don't move, they don't budge. Very excited about using these. And I have a few other things, but I honestly, some stuff that I got before Christmas, but those things have been put away, so I have no idea where they are. But this is it! I know this is being uploaded after the fact, so I hope all of you had a very Merry Christmas. I'm pretty damn sure this is going to be uploaded after New Year's, so I hope again that you guys had a happy New Year's, and look forward to Vlogmas 2014, and I will hopefully get back into the routine of doing uh, my beauty videos and uploading late ones, of course, and the gaming videos. I've been playing Ghosts, still haven't quite figured out how to, like, get the highlight reels like I could with Black Ops 2, so... And you guys can help me out, out with that, comment below or send me a direct message or something. So, I don't know about the gaming videos, but definitely uh, the beauty videos will be back in full rotation. And that is it! Thank you so much to all of you guys that have watched my previous vlog mistakes and commented and liked. I greatly appreciate it. And I look forward to 2014. So, this is Rose from My Animosity, and thank you so much for watching this crap. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Google+. Plus. Um, now, my Google Plus handle has changed, like my YouTube name, to Rose Jacqueline. My Twitter and my Instagram are both my old handle, Rose Jarman. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe for more. And until next time, I hope you guys have a wonderful 2014. And I will talk and see you guys very soon.